Russian army trying to capture Ukrainian Chasivya city suffers heavy losses but attacks continue. Ukrainian military observer Denis Popovich spoke about the developing situation around Chasivya, Donetsk Oblast and Russia's plans to capture the town in an interview with NV. They now want to enter Chasivya from the south, from the village of Ivanivsky, west of Bakhmut, he said. They haven't yet finished the battle for Ivanivsky but are already building up their strength to try to enter Chasivya from the south. Now they're engaged in redeploying troops. Popovich also explained why the Russians stepped up their attacks in this area. I suspect that due to the fact that someone promised someone to capture Chasivya by May the 9th, they set this deadline and they're now in a hurry to at least enter this town to report something, the expert said. This will mean big losses for them, but unfortunately it will also mean losses for us. Therefore, we can state the battle for Chasivya is beginning. Chasivya is currently one of Russia's main targets on the front line and a key point that the Ukrainian forces are trying to hold. Apart from Ukrainian soldiers, even their commanders are manning forward positions to hold off the enemy, the Wall Street Journal recently reported. About 20,000 to 25,000 Russian troops are now assaulting the town. Russian forces appear to be conducting heavy glide bomb strikes against Ukrainian positions to enable further advances towards Chasivya, similar to the way that Russia seized Avdiivka. In February 2024, the Institute for the Study of War reported on April the 9th. The Russian military uses both attack helicopters and CAS warplanes to strike Ukrainian troops. If the Russian occupiers manage to capture Chasivya, they'll have the opportunity to launch an offensive on Kostyantinivka, Druskivka, Kramatorsk, and Slovyansk, a senior Ukrainian official told Politico on April the 16th. Thank <laughs> you. 